Hello everybody, uh, I'm Cap, and I'm going to be going over the shower room early technique. The shower room early technique is a way to get to shower room, which is over here, uh, without breaking down this electric gate, which is, you know, problematic for, you know, most of the time. Um, and this is of course useful in both the exploration kit and all treasures speedruns. The problem is, is that if you're coming from a payoff debt speedrun, you usually, you know, you don't have to do this trick in payoff debt. So, if you don't, you know, if you don't learn it, then, you know, this can be very frustrating if you're trying to learn all treasures or exploration kit, and you only have a payoff debt background. So this is what this tutorial is going to do. So the first thing that you need to understand is that, as you can see when I'm running around here, I have the Rush Brutes Exploration Kit Upgrade. Uh, so you need to have that if you want to even practice this trick. Um, you naturally should have this in both of the speedruns where this matters, so you shouldn't have to worry about it too much. But if you want to practice it, you need to make sure that you have Rush Boots on in your practice file. So you see I have Rush Boots. Um, so yeah. So that's what, uh, so that's the first thing. The second thing is, of course, is you need to have the shower room bridge built. So, you know, you need this basically built. It doesn't have to be built all the way, but at least this section where I'm standing on right now that I'm circling needs to be built. So, the shower room early trick is sort of silly. It basically involves you running against, uh, a bridge in an attempt to get onto this lip so that you can go over the lip and then run into this shower room area. Um, you like a little trick? Yeah, that's a little fun thing I can do one for fun. Any case, so, uh, so I showed you how to do it, but how did I actually do it? Well, uh, in order to properly describe what I'm doing, I first have to get out my handy dandy arrow. So let's, uh, so let's bring that out. Um, so the first thing is, is that it's where you want to aim. So you want to aim just, so this, the, you see this branch right here, right? You want to aim at the empty space right next to it, right here. Uh, the next important thing is important, you need to run into it at a slight angle. If you right, run into it head on, it won't work. But you see how my camera has a slight angle on it right now? That is, um... This line is exactly the line you want to hit, sort of in this gap, a little bit closer to this branch right here, and you want this straight line. The next thing is really easy. You want to just back Olimar up, you know, line Olimar up, back him against the wall, and then you're just going to run, and you want to hold straight. And if you do it right, it should just sort of work. It might not happen every single time, but after a couple tries, whoops, I was the line was a little bit bad. Setting this up is of course the most important thing because if the setup is bad it will never work. Uh, but it's normal to, for it to take a couple tries. If you fail you just... the good news about this trick as opposed to a lot of other tricks in Pikmin 2 is that if you fail it's not a big deal. You just have to you know you, you set it up and try again so it's not like early blues or Lugia skip which is sort of a one shot. And therefore very frustrating. Man, of course I got it the first time when I just sort of talk about it in a vacuum, but now I can't get it as well. But it's just sort of this line. And you see that I'm popping up? The secret is you want to hold forward until, uh, and when you pop up, you should go over the lip. There we go. So yeah, you sort of want to aim to this, and you want to continue holding forward, and eventually you'll pop up to this area. Uh, the important thing is that you keep holding it. A lot of people pop up and then they stop holding forward, and, and that's really bad because you need to have enough momentum to go. So hold forward until, when you set it up, you want to just, you know, aim, and then you want to hold forward until it's a guaranteed failure, right? So I'm just continuing to hold it. And then but when I finally pop up high enough, because I continue holding forward, um, it'll work. And if you let go too early, then it just won't work. So that's sort of a bummer. Uh, since this is a tutorial, you don't have to get it right every time, the first time. As long as you get it, like, you know, like that. As long as you get it in a reasonable number of attempts, you should be okay. 
shot him early is sort of a finicky trick and therefore it can be very frustrating but as long as you sort of aim for this gap and just sort of go for it uh, I have confidence that most runners will uh, start picking up the nuance in order to get it uh, multiple times in a row yeah. there we go alright I hope this video was helpful peace out guys yeah.